to the Ize, J to the Ize. Then you know if you walk, you know if you know if we come play with that, you know if you with that. All right, you know. Jamaica. Are you feeling sad and alone? Do you wish you had someone to talk patwa with or somebody who knew what a janker was? Do you wish there was a Jamaican around but you can't find none? Well, I am here to tell you that Jamaicans are there, they are just in hiding. You see, Jamaicans were very adaptable people, you know. You see, when we move in our area, we learn all the people them walk, talk, eat, drink, everything. And by the time we don't mimic it, them not even know that we are Jamaican anymore. We are doing them things better than them. But there are certain telltale signs of Jamaicanness that if you know to look for them, you can spot the Jamaicans in a crowd. We're not gonna find them easy. You have to know what you're looking for. And I am here to give you a guidebook on how to hunt yardy. I'm doing this vlog in collaboration with Jamaica 50 Toronto. Look here, Jamaica 50 events are going all over the world, you know, because if it's one thing we know how to do, we know how to spread out and take over. So please, find the event that is going on in your area because Curry Goat is running worldwide. At the end of this, I'm going to tell you some events that are going on in Toronto specifically and um, some links to some websites and stuff. But first, I'm going to tell you how to find the Jamaicans. Now, when you are seeking out a Jamaican in foreign, do not go and seek the person. No, no. Because the person has altered themselves so much you don't know they are Jamaican anymore. You go and seek their motor vehicle. Because regardless of how much they don't look Jamaican anymore, Jamaican people treat them care like he's a driving embassy. You're supposed to can go and get passport and a fly to get driver's license and those type of things there. Yes, them going to have a flag somewhere on that car. Out in the street, they call it murder. You just have to look. So you enter the parking lot. Looking at the care of them now. When you look on the headrest, do you see two Jamaica flag and kerchief <laughs> tie up over the headrest? Jamaican care. If them don't put it on the headrest, sometimes you see two big beach towel. A beach towel them put on over the seat like them are the seat cover. Or sometimes if you don't get the Jamaican flag beach towel, you know, you will get either the conquering line of Judah or you're going to get the Ethiopian flag. <laughs> The Ethiopian people don't use them flag as much as Jamaican people use up them flag. Let's talk about globalization. Yeah, looking for that flag. If you don't see it there, look up into the rear view area. Very often this is where they betray their Jamaicanness. You're looking for two boxing gloves hang up like this with Jamaica right right here. So if you don't see that, look for a giant CD with the Jamaican flag. Me I'll see the Jamaican flag pine. Um, you know the pioneer version? Huh? Missy one of that already. Or the teddy bear with the Jamaican t-shirt. Or, and the man who met this thing is making millions. You know them have the flag with the little gold fringe on the bottom? Missy this flag from Guyana, Missy it from Barbados, Missy it from St. Kitts, Missy it from St. Lucia, Missy the flag come from Texas alone. The man who is making this flag is making crazy money. Yes. <laughs> It is you cannot find the Jamaica in the front. Oh, or look down. Do you see a little fan? You see a little fan in the car? Yeah, that's a Jamaican car because the fan is there so that they can save money on air conditioning in the summertime. That's a Jamaican car. But if you can't find Jamaica in the front, look over the back. Up in the back part of the car. Do you see a football with the Jamaican colors on it? Or do you see an entire zoo full of animals over the back of the car? Hear this. Of mercy. Because I don't know if it is that we feel that it makes the car seem more welcoming. Why it is that we have to have an entire glass menagerie of animals put down up there? Teddy bear with a little heart tonight, all of them type of something there. Every type of thumb up there. If it is that you can't find that now, you have to go get really detailed with the thing. Look for patty crumbs. No matter what else that them can turn down, them can stop in curry goat and ox tail, but them cannot turn them back on patty. Look for the patty crumbs they're adding there. Look for the cola champagne that put down in the, the, the drinks thing. Or look for tropical rhythm. Or find somebody. Look on the key ring. Yeah, man. All when them nice and them dainty. Look on the key ring. It is right there. And if all of these things fail now, you have to go and seek the person. There are certain things that Jamaicans do in social settings that they don't even recognize that they do. There is some dead giveaway that they are Jamaican. First thing, walk around the room and introduce yourself. Have you met somebody named Winston, Barrington, Everald, or Everton? These are Jamaican names. They doesn't have to fret. It don't matter what them vice sound like. I don't care which accent they talk with. A Jamaica them come from. If you meet a woman and her name is Daphne, Dawn, Doreen, Doret, Dahlia, Pansy or Evadne, that is a Jamaican woman. Don't let her tell you anything. She will come from Jamaica. Is that where she come from? When they had the dinner table and something happened, like something bad happened, and the person go, mm -mm, 
that sadi that is a jamaican smaddy that nice here uh -uh. nobody else in the world don't make that nice except for we when something good happen now the jamaican smaddy said mm -hmm. yes mm -hmm. you see the emphasis there you have to look out for the emphasis there is a straight jamaican way of talking that all when i'm going this sound is what is going to tell your jamaican is in the room you see that you see that ice where i swirl up they say you hear the ice chick 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 no other country in the world do people do this other than in Jamaica, no, we are else. If you're sitting at a table with somebody and the person wants to show you where somebody is and then point to them out, is a Jamaican that as in, see him there in the polka that frack. See him there. No, you notice I said, see him there in the polka that frack. Jamaican people don't really respect gender like that. No, everybody's him, everybody's him. So see him there in the polka that frack. Yeah, Jamaican people, that's all them deal with the thing. Next thing them do, you can't use the kiss teeth and mark them. Because everybody kiss them teeth. Although people kiss them teeth different. Jamaican people are like, um, I find that like South Asian people, like it's a front mode kiss teeth. And some part of the EC is a front mode kiss teeth too. So you can't use the kiss teeth and mark them again. What you can take and mark them though is, when the party don't know, and everybody is leaving, and somebody like left something and we need to get them back. All Jamaican people going to stop you when you're leaving. Are they going to run you down? No. We're going to stand up where we are and clap. <laughs> All right. All right. Come back. Or better yet to go here. Oi. Oi. No other place in the world. Missy other places. Missy people get up and run down the car. No, we're not going to run the car. We're not bust no sweat. We're not busting any type of sweat over this. We're going to stay exactly where we are and we're going to clap you. So that is all your point. You're, you're catching Jamaicans. It's very technical, you know. Like them can't hide, you know. But it's like sometimes when crisis come, the Jamaica just jump up in at them. They never know what's coming. That's all yes, but them. The next one I'm going to do is how to know that you have stumbled into a Jamaican neighborhood. When you get to a neighborhood and there are lions on the gates, yeah, you're in the Jamaica neighborhood now. Prepare your body. There's going to be a jerk pan coming out on the side of the road come seven o'clock regardless of what it is going to happen so that is the next one though that is the next one so as i said i'm doing these vlogs in conjunction with jamaica 50 toronto um you can follow them on twitter at jamaica 50 um jamaica 50 as in jamaica jamaica 50 is at jamaica 50 underscore um jamaica 50 canada is jamaica 50.ca jamaica50 for home is jamaica50.com so go to any of those websites please check out the events that are going on jamaica50 toronto has three events coming up there's jam for jamaica on april 21st there is jamaican rhythms on june 28th and there is a land we love gala on august 11th um if you go to the website you can find contact information also if you look up jamaica50 on facebook all the information is there and you can link them up on twitter Please go out and support these events. This is our 50th year. We only get this once. Like we get the 49 twice. No, we don't get any of them twice, but 50. Come on, you know what I mean? 50 years of independence. You're one big country now. I mean, we're not that big. We're not that big. But yo, what green other thing? Everybody just run out. Yo, meet up all of this up and my eyelash. You know, you can just look for me doing every type of brookings and dinky minute to inappropriate music. You know, then I play waltz in music and my dinky minute. You know, I don't care. I'm here to celebrate my heritage. Okay, so big ups everybody. Check out the Jamaica 50 website. So support the events wherever you are. There are events all over the world. Get involved. Yeah, that's all you spot the Jamaicans. I'm gonna tell you next time. As I said, how to know when you're going to the neighborhood. And if you have stumbled into the neighborhood, please have hot sauce ready because there is going to be some type of cooking. One in on in. Take care of yourself. Peace and love. See my flag there with all the appropriate colors represented. Good. Bye bye.